Are you feeling increasingly detached from nature and our ancestors' innate ability to take care of ourselves? Are you part of the great resignation and have less income but more time on your hands? Are you tired of spending money on things you don't actually need and are digging an impossible hole of consumer debt for yourself? Are you worried about our exposure and consumption of man-made chemicals and the destruction of our earth? Do politics, greed, industry, and big corporations' heavy-handed attempts to control you make you angry? Are you getting fed up with the supply chain problems, rising prices, and empty grocery store shelves? If you want to live a simpler life and be in charge of your own happiness, you'll want to become more self-sufficient and independent, free from the shackles of contrived modern problems. I want to help you gain the competence and confidence to be in control of your own life, be more self-reliant, capable, secure, healthy, and happy so that you can enjoy each and every day in the moment. I want you to live a mindful and meaningful life. If you'd like to learn more, please click the subscribe button below and like this video to join me in this journey of becoming an urban homesteader to whatever degree that works for you. You might rent an apartment, live in your own home in town, or even have a small acreage to work with. All you need to do is begin. Here are some things that my channel will help you implement towards becoming more self-sufficient and independent. I'll put links to some that I've already covered in my channel in the description box below, and the rest will be covering in upcoming videos. Start small and master one or two at a time. Number one, grow your own food. Sprouts in a jar like this, which you can do year round. Grow hydroponically indoors. Grow in a garden tower, either indoors or out, even on your balcony. Grow in pots. Raise beds like the ones that I constructed here. An in-ground garden. Trellises use vertical space very efficiently. Planting bags. Have an herb garden. Number two, harvest wild foods. You can go foraging for mushrooms, herbs, medicinals, and other edibles. You can go fishing. You can even learn how to hunt. Number three, learn to cook from scratch. You can make simple weeknight recipes or dinners better than any restaurant. Plan your meals. Make your own sourdough bread like I've shown in this video. Or crackers, pasta, and baked goods. Make your own yogurt and cheese. Make your own beverages. Learn how to improvise for meals using what you have on hand. Compost your kitchen waste. You can use an under sink compost can like this one that I just got. You can also have an outdoor compost bin or pile. Links to the one I just got are in the description box below. Vermiculture system. Click up here for my video on worm composting. Number five, food preservation. Vacuum sealing and freezing are probably the easiest. Dehydrating, which I've done a bunch of. Water bath canning, which is pretty easy to get started with. Fermenting, like these cranberries I made for the holidays, or the kimchi and sauerkraut that I made in these videos. Pressure canning, which I just started doing in this video. And you can smoke your food. Number six, backyard livestock. You can raise chickens for eggs and meat, like I did when I lived in the hills, or turkeys and ducks and quail, bees, goats, pigs, rabbits, maybe even horses and cows, depending on what your municipality allows. Number seven, DIY everything you can. You can make your own cleaning products, herbal skincare and medicinal remedies. You can cut your own hair like I've been doing for years. Learn how to sew, knit, crochet, or quilt. Recycle and reuse for less waste. Go thrift store shopping or garage sailing. Learn woodworking and building like I made the catio here or my gardens. Repair and maintenance on your own. Number eight, energy usage reduction. You can burn firewood for heat. Use solar power. Collect rainwater. Dry your laundry on a clothesline outside. Number nine, community. You can swap goods with friends and neighbors, coworkers, and other homesteaders, like I trade raspberries for farm eggs with a coworker. Number 10, financial independence. Become debt-free. Work from home. Maybe even retire early. Tell me in the comments if you've already mastered some of these or which ones excite you the most to add to your tool belt. I'll be adding content once a week as I have been 
as we become more self-sufficient together, one skill at a time. Watch this video where I show you how to make your own cleaning solution to get started.